So I will not be buying another Subaru in my lifetime. Is it slipping? Ain't no quitting. I'm on a mission, feeling driven. Ain't no stopping till the tire's spinning. Resuscitate the rod, it's the nursing garage. 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 What's up, y'all? Kyle is officially starting to take apart the turbo on the car so we can get it going, seeing what's exactly wrong with it. Hopefully, we pull this turbo and it's in 50 pieces and I'll be really relieved. So yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and pull this turbo. I'm gonna set you guys up. You guys enjoy the show. Might give a little time lapse and yeah, hopefully in the next few scenes at the end of this video, I'm on my way to Florida. So this should be fun. I'll see you guys in a minute. All the shaft play. She was shot, boys. Let's hope there's no seals in this. Kyle thinks it's 100%. It's got a lot of shaft play. Dude, that other one is kind of monster yeah. compared to that one. Yeah, that's actually big. So guys, what our problem and our dilemma that we're going with right now is this, this is a WRX turbo. This is an STI turbo. See the little difference there? Why on earth? Did they put a WRX turbo on STI turbo? And another thing is, look at, see this? No shaft play, no up and down, no nothing. Solid. This, I, guess, I don't know if you guys can see it. Cool and still leaking. Okay, y'all. This is the situation here. So, this turbo that we got isn't clocked right or this is the old turbo and it's clocked up so we're gonna make this work to be clocked up but because it's not 90 we just have a situation on our hands guys so we're gonna make this adapter we're gonna make this thicker and uh hopefully it works guys i mean it's gonna work but it's just gonna take some more time than we were hoping so yeah hopefully it's finish this up it stops raining a little bit and then knock this out real quick all right y'all what's up so this is a crazy thing that happened so the turbo that we got won't work i'll drop in some pictures about it again fortunately cj's a real one he said just come take the one off of my car so you don't have to fight with this one anymore because we've been fighting with this one you guys seen last night we're trying to build stuff for it it's not working this it's one's a pretty stock one so hopefully we'll be able to well i mean it's gonna work so oh it'll work it's gonna work so Hopefully this will get us back on the road. This is solve all our problems. And hopefully be in Florida. So shout out again to CJ, man. He's really coming through to help us. So I'll see you guys when we get this thing out. This is actually even a better turbo than the one that was even on it. And that thing's tight like a tiger. Literally tight like a tiger. This one's at least. You feel that? All right, now there should be nothing to hold it back because it's literally just going right back into place where exactly the old turbo was. Let's just get it popping. I'm done playing around. Let's start this thing up. Let's bounce rev eliminators. Let's go make someone's grandparents very unhappy down this dirt road. And we're gonna have fun tonight. All right. Well, guys, I um, 
we did the turbo and we took it for a test drive and uh it just grenaded itself i mean it won't even start it's locked up this is a bad idea for Devin. kyle how much are we in the hole now the only way I needed a shirt block. Oh my gosh! I just grenaded the fudging. I gotta bleep that out. Car. Dude, I can't believe you just yeeted this motor. Hey, yep. I call my little cousin. All right, guys. So this is the situation. Austin came to the rescue. Shout out to him. Engine is not blown up. Wink, wink. It's blown. Um. So yeah. What do you say? Alright, so shout out Austin for picking shout this out up. Shout out to work. <laughs> for paying me to be here, huh? <laughs> so we're going to get towed back to Dakota's dad's. Yeah. We are moving out right now, guys. We're going just kidding. We're being towed. So what had happened was is we blew the motor, we think. I have every check engine light on right now. So I will not be buying another Subaru in my lifetime. But yeah, I'll see you guys when we park it and figure it out. What's up guys? I'm obviously back in Florida. It's beautiful out. I can't get enough of it. But uh, unfortunately guys, we had to leave one behind and it had to be the STI. So uh, unfortunately guys, we're not gonna be able to keep it because it's got a lot of engine problems obviously. So it's not, it's not enough to bring it back home per se. So uh, yeah, what a bummer. But you know what guys, it's nobody's fault. This is just what happens, you know what I mean? I flew literally 2,000 miles to pick up a car I've never seen before in my life. I've seen a couple pictures of it. i never seen a video of it even running. So we took a gamble, didn't pay off. It's life, guys. I'm not mad at nobody. But what I am happy about, though, Keith has been grinding on this truck, guys. I'm talking. We got some stuff coming for you guys in the next video. Hopefully, we get the truck started, guys. I'm at back-to-back -back 16s at work, but I'm going to try to get over to the place try to put a couple hours in for you guys so you guys can see the truck progress i'm so excited mine's back on the truck so yeah guys thank you so much for continuing to follow the channel and supporting you guys and like always guys if you want to leave a like leave a like if not please leave a comment so i'll see you guys uh next video and you promise you probably aren't going to want to miss that one so i'll see you guys later later